Good evening, it's Pastor Trish. Happy Monday, January 18th. And we are on Psalm 98 this evening, which is a psalm of praise. A couple of times this afternoon when I was in my car and I had the radio on, I heard a couple of different reports about the vaccine and about um, um, where, where it's at, basically. One was the, um, the state update on what they're doing and rolling out a, I think, a pilot project of some kind or something, trying to start getting people 65 and older vaccinated. And the other one was um, uh, NPR's uh, Francis Collins. That's who it was talking about it. At any rate, I bring it up because depending on your frame of mind or reference, you might decide that what you heard today in those stories was good news or not good news. And it, and it was like, even the newscasters were like, well, is that good news or bad news? Is that something that people should be happy about or complaining about? And I thought that's true in a lot of things, right? We can hear the same story and depending on our frame of reference, we might see it as positive or we might be complaining about it. And I think this psalm, as a psalm of praise, invites us to be positive and to see the good that can happen even in sometimes some difficult kinds of situations and things. And so this is a pure psalm of praise. And I, I offer it up for us tonight with that sense that even in difficult times, whether you've had a good day or a not so good day or a hard uh, weekend or you're looking forward to a good week, whatever it is, God invites us to give God praise and to sing a new song, which is the way this psalm talks, and to invite all of creation to praise and to see the good that is happening all around us all the time. So this is Psalm 98, and I will pray it tonight from the Message Translation. Sing to God a brand new song. He's made a world of wonders. He rolled up his sleeves. He set things right. God made history with salvation, and he showed the world what he could do. He remembered to love us, a bonus to his dear family Israel, indefatigable love. The whole earth comes to attention. Look, God's work of salvation. Shout your praises to God, everybody. Let loose and sing. Strike up the band. Round up an orchestra to play for God. Add on a hundred voice choir. Feature trumpets and big trombones. And fill the air with praises to King God. Let the sea and its fish give a round of applause with everything living on earth joining in. Let ocean breakers call out encore and mountains harmonize the finale. A tribute to God when he comes, when he comes to set the earth right. He'll straighten out the whole world. He'll put the world right and everyone in it. So a song of praise as well as a song of hope tonight. And it's always good to have hope. I pray that your week will be good, that you will find ways to sing a new song to God and to sing out praise. Remind you that we are going to do an extra devotion tomorrow night, a, a short worship service, prayer service for our nation. And uh, six o'clock still, and you will find it on the Messiah website. We'll Facebook live it right to the church website. All right. Thanks much. We'll see you soon.